Welcome to Mechanical Tutorial. I am going to teach you different techniques in SOLIDWORKS for mechanical engineers. I am going to train you different modules like part modeling, surface modeling, sheet metal enclosure design, plastic components design, product design, reverse engineering, simulation and many more tips and tricks in SOLIDWORKS. Hi, today I am going to explain about how to save custom sectional view. So left side you can see the sectional view and right side is the saved custom view. See this is the assembly. So if I make the cross section, say ok. See this is how it looks like. If I keep it in right side view, this is. So this is the cross section. So here. I want to see this view frequently. So when I press the space bar, I can have these saved views. See here. So this is a one more cross section view. So I'm going to show you how to create the specific sectional view so that we can view frequently during our design. So, so this is the assembly, so I am selecting the sectional view here and here we can select any sectional view selecting any plane. So if I select this plane, so it is selecting the front plane, see here. So this is the sectional view of this assembly. So when I select the top line, it creates in the direction. Similarly, we can create the sectional view according to selected plane. See here. See. If I say OK and I want to see this view frequently. So select the space bar and select new view so it shows sectional view say ok suppose if i keep the isometric view and i want to see the sectional view in the right plane so simply select the space bar and select this one save one so this is one of the advantage now i am going to create one more for better understanding select the sectional view command so one direction i have selected right plane and second section i am going to select front plane see here so i am placing exactly here see this so see this the shaft is one fourth so i want to see this in isometric for example in this manner so select the space bar and select new view we can rename it if you want so i am keeping as it is sectional view and say ok now i am going to see both the sectional views which i have created earlier see here this is the assembly and select space bar and this is the sectional view and the second one which I have created now is this. So we do not have to click this command frequently and uh, move this plane for uh, to the required position. Simply we can save this sectional view and uh, we can view as many times we want and we can use this in the drawing as well. So this is a brief about uh, how to save custom sectional view 
Thanks for watching.